Now with Godzilla Kong The New Empire releasing about a month from now, I just felt like I needed to talk about this movie, especially about what I'm really excited to see in this movie. So without any further ado, let's just get straight into the video. I'm already saying it, the Scar King is gonna be an absolute menace. We already saw him fight Kong in a small scene uh, during the trailer, where we see he actually has a very skill based fighting style. I mean it makes sense, just take a look at him, he's very lanky while Kong is way more bulky compared to him. So it makes sense that he needs to be very skilled at fighting to actually match Kong and perhaps even outmatch him. Adam Wingard, who directed this movie and also directed Godzilla vs Kong back in 2021, actually stated that the Skull King is actually the biggest threat the Monsterverse has ever seen. Now, of course he only said that to promote the movie, but I'm actually curious because it might not be even that wrong. Because I know it seems like the Skull King is not even that strong, I mean I'm pretty sure Godzilla would easily beat him in a 1v1 and we've already seen creatures like Ghidorah or Mechagodzilla which were physically way stronger than the Skull King. But what I think makes Skull King an actual menace is probably the fact that he has this army of apes which obey to him and actually fight for him and with him and also he has Shimo by his side so I think the Skull King is actually gonna be a menace. Now that we are already talking about Shimo, I'm really excited to see it in action. Now, I love the fact that in the trailer they kind of tease it, but they don't really show it to kind of still make it a surprise when you're actually be in theaters and actually see it. I love that. And yeah, apparently it is the first Titan to have ever existed and it has some really cool ice powers, for example an ice breath. I think that's pretty cool. And apparently its nickname is the Godzilla that ate a star, which is kind of fire. I'm still not sure if it is a female or a male, some people say it's male, some people say it's female. We'll never really know until the movie comes out. And yeah, I think that's about it. Yeah, it's also really huge. Um, I think if you pause the trailer you actually saw a picture of him uh, next to Godzilla and he's like on all of his fours, but like still as tall as Godzilla so like he's gonna be huge or she. In the final shot of the Japanese trailer which for some reason is different than the American trailer because that's really weird like in most countries they just reuse the same trailer and just with the dub in the respective language but the Japanese and Chinese trailer they were suddenly different which I don't know why but that's just the way it is. But I'm not complaining because we see Godzilla actually standing inside the Colosseum. Now I was born in Milan which is in Italy and also lived there for like six years and honestly I'm really excited to see this. I mean if my co home country is getting leveled by fucking Godzilla which is probably one of my favorite movie characters of all time and for surely my favorite kaiju I'm just excited to see that like I'm not even lying that's gonna be so cool. Now there have been some rumors that a few certain titans will appear in this movie. I'm not gonna mention them considering that yes it wasn't confirmed by the makers that these kaijus will actually appear but in case they would appear I don't want to spoil you guys so I'm just gonna say there are certain titans from King of the Monsters apparently and also a few titans or I think only one I'm not sure from the graphic novels that's all I'm gonna say. Now if that's actually true I'm so excited to see these creatures, I mean I always love it when they kind of show more of the creatures which perhaps didn't get much screen time in the past movies, so I'm really excited to see this, I mean and I always love to see more kaijus and creatures, so yeah. The fan favorite dog. Now I am really excited to see this. Um, it was confirmed because there is a certain action figure which was leaked where you can get Suko and dog together and I'm not never gonna get these action figures. However, that way yes, we know that dog will appear in the movie. Um, I hope he gets more than just about 5 seconds screen time like in Godzilla vs Kong. I hope he does more than just a cameo. I mean if it is a scene which is only about five minutes I'm already happy so yeah I'm really excited to see him 
Yes, guys, that's about it. I don't think I have anything else to say. These are the things I'm really excited to see in the movie. Um, I mean, there are, of course, a lot of things I'm looking forward to um, in the movie. But these are the things which I'm really excited. Like, I'm excited the most about this movie. So, yeah, I think it's releasing 29th March, which is only about a month away from now. So, yeah, that's it. See ya, guys. I'm really excited for this movie.